I think that I'm not having the, the same feeling, don't you think? Yeah. Let's start again. Alright. Do you know that is very uh, popular now, something called Ora Loca. I don't know if you heard about it. No, Ora Loca is uh, on the wedding party, uh, right like after the middle of the party, like towards the end when you want to have people dancing and more so it comes in drums and dancers and we really do a small carnival like so for people to be really on your their best and they dance and it's very very interesting and the, the closing like one of these huge extravagant costumes they weigh around you know 70 to 100 110 pounds I was always behind the scenes since uh, I created Brazilian B. So I am the one taking care of choreographies and uh, like how everything is going. I many times am, am the MC. So I present, I explain the culture. I wanted something that was more choreographed, with more glamour, with more feathers and colors and all that Brazil has to offer. I started by looking for a place, so I need a studio. And the first thing that I wanted was an image. An image of when you step for the first time in the avenue of Samba that is in Rio where all the carnival parades take place, that is an emotion that is like, it's hard to describe. This is like a big avatar because she's taller than us. She goes all the way in the wall and she has this expression of a really passionate for what she does. And I remember once when I was in Russia that they would paint portraits and they would put real jewelry on them. And I said, Where was it? In Moscow? Yeah, I think it was on St. Petersburg and uh, like the museum, like what's the name of this huge museum? Hermitage. That, uh, Hermitage, exactly. And I said, one day, I, I don't know, I want to do something like inspired on that. And then that's how we came with feathers and beads and stones and all kind of materials that would help bring more life to this painting. So after I created this space was the second stage. I had to bring all the costumes here. Remember, they weigh between 60 and 110 pounds each. Each of these costumes are like That's two beautiful. huge bags. It looks like uh, surfboards, like big, two huge bags like that because they fold, you know. But imagine, I have eight of them here. So it, it was really like an adventure till I had all here. And then once I had all here was the time to start auditions. I got some artists and we started rehearsing. So you've been working on and off with the Brazilian beat for over 20 years now. You yeah. can say that? Yeah, for sure. Uh, you must have so many great stories of your travels. What is your favorite? What stands out in your memory? the 700 years of the Grimaldi dynasty. So we have picture with, you know, the King of Monaco, with Stephanie, Albert, you know. So it is, uh, it's interesting how culture cross borders. It doesn't matter what language you speak, no matter if you're 80 years old or 80 years old, you know, you're welcome and you will feel good and comfortable in our events. Okay.